Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be making tater type casserole and I'll also be cleaning up the kitchen afterwards. So if you're interested in this recipe and want to watch me clean, then please get watching. Okay guys, so in today's video, I'm going to be making tater type casserole. So in this video, I'm going to be using one pound of hamburger meat, one can of cream of chicken, some shredded cheese, any kind you want, I always use this mix, and then tater tots. What I'm going to do is cook the meat in the skillet, and then when the meat is done, the oven will be preheated to the temperature of the tater tots, and I will layer everything in a casserole dish to go in meat, can of cream of chicken, cheese, and then I'll top it with tater tots, and then we'll bake it according to the tater tot packaging. So if you want to see this video, then let's get watching. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is preheat the oven so it's ready by the time the meat is done. And I'm going to cook the meat and I'm also going to add seasoning to the meat. I'm adding seasoning, salt, pepper, and garlic powder. So my hamburger meat is all fried up. I'm going to strain it and then we will layer everything in the casserole dish. Okay, so next thing we're going to do is layer the soup on top of it. layer the tater tots. ready to go. The oven is almost to temperature so I'm just going to wait and then I'll pop it in the oven. Now that I got everything in the oven cooking I'm going to go ahead and start cleaning the dishes that were here already and then after we eat I will clean the dishes I used tonight.
so this is what it looks like all done. We actually ate and I forgot to get a clip, but I just made some broccoli and cheese. I usually don't make nothing with it, but I needed to cook the broccoli. Okay guys, so this is going to wrap up today's video. I really hope you enjoyed the recipe. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And if there's any other recipes you want me to cook, then please let me know down in the comments.